Hi guys, thanks for watching. Um, I know I haven't filmed a video in a really long time and I apologize for that. I, I am planning on doing a video where I update you what I've been up to for the last 10 months. I don't even know, like, I've kind of filmed sporadically in 2021, but I don't think I've really explained, like, what's all transpired since December when I was moving and um, got COVID and everything that happened after that. So, um I've had a lot of like major life changing events this year and um, it's just like one thing after another that just like leads me down a weird spiral of being busy but really not being busy. I don't even, I feel like I haven't done anything but I'm just constantly going, going, going. Um, I will update you guys. Um, I feel like you deserve that. Especially people who have been watching me for a really long time. And it's not like I think you really, like some people just don't, they don't really care. You know, they're just like happy to see videos back or whatever. But some people do want to know where I've been and what I've been up to. So I will, I will update you. It's just a matter of when I can do that. And my, I, I wanted to take you guys on a little tour through my house, but it's just, it's been such a work in progress and it's like a cluttery mess in every room. And I don't want to do a video when it's like that. So I'm trying to get my shit together. And um, everything is just taking a lot longer than I expected it to. So most recently, my poor baby tiger had to go in for a vet visit on Thursday. It's now Sunday night. And he had three teeth extracted and he, he was not doing well. It was very scary for the first two days. I didn't think he was going to make it through. Um... He wasn't responding well afterward, eating or drinking or going to the bathroom or anything. He just was just sleeping and lethargic and um, he's pulling through. I don't know if you're going to be able to see him here. Oh, probably not. Mm, you can't really see him. <laughs> he's facing us. Tiger just at the top of the stairs. Tiger! Can you see his eye peeking through? <laughs> Tiggy! Anyway, he, um, he's doing a lot better, but he was not doing well, and I was just a wreck, so. Anyway, um, I have a Bath and Body Works haul to show you. Shamefully, it is from the summer semi-annual sale, so my receipt says June 21st. I'm pretty sure I exchanged, like, one or two things, I don't remember, so, uh, and I, I tried to, like, look at my receipt, but, you know, it's, I have no idea. It looks like I exchanged, I don't know, it's weird because it looks like I exchanged three candles, but I have no idea what they would be. Um, I think there's, like, a Wildberry Jam donut. Was that a candle? If it was, I'm pretty sure I burned it and it smelled terrible or didn't smell at all or something. And then there's one that says, like, strawberry... It looks like strawberry pound cake, but I, I know that I didn't return one of those. And then a vanilla something, and I didn't. I don't know what candle that would be either. So I really have no idea. But I know sometimes people like to know if it's an exchange or not for some reason. I did, however, exchange the soaps were an exchange because the soaps were a vanilla bean Noel soap, not vanilla bean Noel. I know maybe it was. Vanilla something. Vanilla snowflake? No. Vanilla bean Noel it must have been. And it didn't smell good. It smelled terrible. So I exchanged them. So um, I will show you the soaps. I, I got a vanilla cloud, which is whipped vanilla, apple blossom, and sandalwood. And oceanfront garden. I really like the subtle tones of these soaps. They're not like bright and zippy. Uh, distracting salted orchid beach grass and lemon zest I just think they're like classy and I should have used them this summer but I forgot <laughs> I forgot I even had this it was in my closet beach bliss and this is ocean breezes water flowers and creamy musk um I don't love the foaming ones they're definitely more drying I do really like this gentle gel 
However, I feel like the gentle gel does not foam and it doesn't go a long way. I just don't feel like my hands are super clean. I like the deep cleansing and there's a different formulation that I like as well and I can't remember what that is right now. And then I will get I will always get foaming if there's, you know, the other formulations aren't available, but I still want that. Um I have my camera at a weird angle, so I can't tell if I'm putting these straight or not. Um yeah, I'll always be willing to get the foaming if there isn't anything else. Um, and then I got body care. I bought a shower gel and a lotion. So I got into the night. I don't know if I have this. I, I think I had it in minis. I may have used up a couple of them. Um, but I know that I've grabbed them as freebie minis when I, when I could. Um, but I decided to get a full size set because that scent does smell pretty good. Sorry. I really, um, I don't have this spaced out very well at all. There isn't a lot to show you. I just have three candles left. Um, but Into the Night, yeah, it smells awesome. It's strong. It's pretty. I feel like it could be a unisex scent. It's probably more feminine, but that's okay. Um, it's just a really, really pretty scent. I think it's awesome. And I hope they don't get rid of it anytime soon because it's strong. So, like, you can just wear the body care and that could act as your perfume. But the perfume or the body spray just smells so good too. So anyway, yeah. Okay, I got a pink lemonade candle. I had one other one of these that I burned through that will be in an empties video. I can talk about that more and how that went. Um, I do really like this scent. This isn't one that I am going to chop up into melts. I just, I don't, I don't need to do that. I think it's like, I'll enjoy it. And then move on. Um, and I don't think it burned terribly. Without going into too much detail. Because I don't want to ramble. Um, but yeah. I'll just burn through that one. Second one that I got is Island Margarita. Really pretty packaging. What can I say? It's Island Margarita. I don't know the last time I've had this candle. It's been a very, very, very long time. Um, I bought this candle. In this color and everything for my sister. And then I decided to get one for myself down the road, but I bought her that one a long time ago. And then the last one I got is Rainbow Confetti, which I'm pretty sure is Marshmallow's Cereal Marshmallow Bar, which I do really enjoy. Kind of some fun tie-dye packaging. I don't love the tie-dye, um, but I like the texture of it. I like that it's like easy to hold and not super slippery. So that's everything. Um, not super exciting, but that's all I have to show you. So thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys soon, and I appreciate you hanging in there if you're still subscribed. Um, welcome back to my, to my channel. Yeah, thanks for hanging in there, and I'll talk to you soon. All right, bye.